Welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing okay. And I hope you are in a super Christmassy mood. I know it's early. I know it's only November, but I, I just can't wait. I literally can't wait to get going with Christmas and I wanna bring you guys along with me. So for today's vlog, we are going to be decorating the house for Christmas. There's a lot to do. I don't know if I'm going to get it all done today. I might do a little bit more tomorrow. Um, but yeah, I thought I thought it'd be nice to bring you guys along, show you the little bits that I've collected in my Christmas decor collection. Some of it's from last year, you might recognise it. Some of it is new this year and I am super excited about it actually. Um, but yeah, welcome to my channel. Welcome to this vlog. Obviously, if you enjoy this video, don't forget to like and subscribe. It really does mean a lot. Um, oh, hi, Lily. Hi. Um, and yeah, I guess we'll get into the vlog. Um, if you haven't already, make sure to get yourself cozy. Go get yourself a nice hot drink. Um, we have got a lot of cute content coming. Um, so yeah, get cozy and let's let's do this video. Obviously, before we get started on the decor, we have to do a little bit of baking. So today, I'm just gonna make some really quick mince pies. I'm just using some roll-out pastry and some shop-brought mince meat to make these super quick pies. Baby, this here is just gonna be you and me Hang by the fire and chill Isn't this how it is supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories Oh, and I've been longing to hold you close Forget about everyone else Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories Oh, oh, la da 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 Oh, 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 Making our Christmas memories Yes, these are the good times with you Don't even care what we do So I have brought my Christmas collection downstairs That is a lot of it um, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna start in the living room and then work my way through the kitchen and up to the rest of the house um, I'll timestamp everything down below and then everything that I use I will try and find either that item or similar and link it in the description so if you're interested, I'll try and find those for you. And yeah, let's uh, let's get to this. I feel like we need a little bit of Christmas music. This is a new playlist I found on Spotify, which I feel like has quite a lot of good tunes on it actually. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna connect it to the Alexa. What is gonna be our first song? Ooh, a little bit of Elvis Presley. Let's connect it. Here we go. Oh, exciting! So next we're getting started with the living room. I'm going to start off by showing you guys a little bit of the scene that I'm doing on the mantelpiece. I am super excited about this. The trees I got from the range, they just remind me so much of the Grinch. And then the houses I got from the range and from TK Maxx. Making sure you've been behaving okay Merry Christmas, honey yeah. The snowman's dusting off his hat Putting on the show for everybody To give them a smile that lasts another year Finally then, I'm going to add some Christmas stockings. I got these ones from B&M and I just think they are actually the cutest thing. I've got a T for Tom and an N for Nelly. I haven't found an S yet and I need to go looking for one. I'm also adding this white bro that I got from TK Maxx or HomeSense. to 
the kitchen. I'm starting off with this doormat I got from H&M. I just think it's absolutely beautiful. And then also moving to the table, I got these placemats from B&M, super, super cheap and really just kind of like rustic looking, which I absolutely love. There's something that happens then I'm just adding some white berries to the current eucalyptus stems that I have got in my little jug. Yeah. Final thing to add is my Christmas mugs. These are my Rendell mugs. You guys know I'm absolutely obsessed. I used them last year and they are coming out again because I just, I love them so much. Guys, let me tell you, this year, TK Maxx or HomeSense totally provided. I got this beautiful set, which has a tea towel with a little bit of mistletoe on, and then also some beautiful oven gloves. So, so happy with these. But then also, I got this stunning set of plates. It's Merry Christmas, baby. Moving on to the bedroom, I am just stripping off my bed, getting rid of the pumpkin bedding because autumn is over and putting on my Christmassy bedding, starting off with the sheets and pillow covers. I've been waiting this whole year, dear Christmas, Christmas, Christmas night. I know you may stop a light, but together we're alright. You know we're ready for Christmas. Can we do? Okay, guys. As you can probably tell, it has got a little bit later in the evening, but I'm just making some fresh bedding. I've added some brushed cotton like sheets. I got them from M and I can't lie, guys. I am obsessed with M&S sheets. They are absolutely incredible. Especially if you've got like a really deep duvet, not duvet, sorry if you can hear Nelly, a really deep um, like mattress. We have a really deep mattress and the like they, they do like these deep sheets. I love them, I'm obsessed. Okay, I'm just gonna add on the duvet covers and this is, I'm just gonna turn the camera angle a bit actually. This is what I am the most excited for. I have got these super cute brushed cotton duvet sheets that have got little um, Christmas trees on. So it is reversible, so it's got this green side, but then it's also got a like green white side, like that, which is just so cute. This is the brush side, so I think I'm gonna have this on the inside that I can feel it when I'm in bed. Um, I got this from Asda, it was part of the Stacey Solomon range. I've got a few other bits to show you from that range. Um, but for now, I'm just gonna get this bedding onto the bed. I'm so excited. Christmas bedding is like literally my favorite thing. I don't know why my camera's not focusing on me. There we go. Christmas bedding is literally my favorite thing. Definitely one of my favorite parts of Christmas. So yeah, let's, let's get it on the bed and uh, let's see it in action. So I have put the bedding up, which you can kind of see behind me, but I'll show you guys properly in a minute. Um, I'm not entirely sure what I think about it yet. I don't know if it's a bit dark. That's my only worry. But I thought I'll show you the other bits that I've got to go with it, which are also from the Stacey Solomon range. Um, or at least I think they are. Yes. They definitely are. Uh, so the first thing I've got is this little kind of like tufted Christmas tree pillow. It looks like that. I think it's really, really cute. So I'm gonna add that. And then I've also got, but I'm torn as to whether to use this in 
the bedroom or in the living room but it is just a really plain fro but with these tufted snowflakes on them which I just think is so so cute the fro oh they don't have the prices on them I don't think they were much what was I gonna say I don't think they were too expensive but what I will say is I have seen a very very similar style of fro in home sense maybe double the price so if you're after a bargain and some kind of more budget friendly Christmas decor definitely check out Asda I have seen on TikTok literally today that Tesco is getting their stuff in as well and I've seen that they've got loads of like cockapoo style Christmas stuff which obviously you you know I would love but I'm trying not to buy any more stuff so I'm gonna try and hold myself back I'm thinking maybe just a little cheeky mug I, don't, I feel like getting one mug a year is a very controlled and I haven't brought a mug this year yet which is scaring me a little bit to be honest so maybe maybe I'll get a little mug maybe that's okay um but I'm gonna go ahead and add on these cushions and froze but then also I'm gonna add on the ones that I normally have on this bed and see if I kind of like all of that together I have also got a jelly cat in my wardrobe so I might grab that out too um and see I'm gonna try a few different things and see what I think um so yeah let's see how that goes because I'm feeling a bit stressed about it this is definitely not the normal vibe I go for in a room so I'm feeling a bit nervous let's 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 see how it goes I guess <laughs> I haven't taken the tags off any of it yet. What do you guys think? So that's with the kind of like snowflake bedding and then I've got a fluffy fro on under that. And then I've got two fluffy pillows and then the like Christmas tree pillow. Is it is it giving the vibes? I just can't tell. I can't tell if I love it or if it's not giving what I thought. I'm really torn. I don't know whether to try like another style just in case. Maybe I'll, I'll show you guys another version of what I was imagining and then you can tell me which you think looks better in the comments. Bear with me. Let's put the food on the table Fast as we're able Guess they coming at Okay, so this is our second option. So we've just gone for a plain rock, white throw. This time it's kind of slightly fluffy. And then pan it up slightly and we've got the two like triangular, no like di <laughs> diamonds shaped pillows and then like a christmas tree jelly cat in the middle let me know which one is your guys favorite in the comments because i really can't decide and it's kind of stressing me out i'm gonna leave it like this for now and i'm gonna have a think about it but i'm completely torn so i welcome any thoughts please just to finish off the room i am adding this garland that i brought from bnm i absolutely love it it's all frosted and cute Shine on Christmas star Shine on So next is the bathroom in this room I am adding a new soap I got this from the Holly's farm shop and I just think it's so cute in the shape of a little Christmas tree I absolutely love it also in this room, I'm going to be adding some new towels. I got these from TK Maxx HomeSense. Again, guys, I can't get over how cute these towels are. They just match, match the room perfectly. Things and what really matters Just look up might already know I do normally fill up this jar that I got from Ikea with some different bath bombs from Lush 
I haven't actually had a chance yet to get any. I went into the shop the other week, but it was just so busy and full. I just felt a bit too overwhelmed. I was just like, you know what? It's fine. I'll just wait at, wait, and I'll get some at a later date. So I will show you guys the bath bombs that I get for my little jar, but I just haven't got them yet. I'm really sorry, guys. It has been a few days and I managed to make it to Lush. These are some little Rudolph bath bombs that I managed to pick up. I still want to get a few more bath bombs, but I feel like we've made a start. to decorate is the attic. I've added this garland, a pillow and a little fro. The pillow is from Next. And then I've also added another fro which I got from TK Maxx. I put this over a little rocking chair which I think is really nice. And I've also added a few berries here and there just to spread the kind of red colour around in the room. Okay guys, that brings us to the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it's made you feel a little bit Christmassy. Sorry guys, Nettie really wants me to play. I hope it's made you feel a little bit Christmassy um, and I hope it's given you a little bit of inspiration for your own decor. If it has, then comment down below. I absolutely love to hear what's going on with you guys and what you've maybe enjoyed from these videos. So 100% let me know down below. Also, please don't forget, do give me your opinions on the bedding and the pillows because it is still playing on my mind. And yeah, I just, I guess that's it really. Obviously, don't forget to like and subscribe. This is only the start of the Christmassy content. Um, but I hope you've enjoyed it. And I hope you're ready for a whole lot more Christmas. It's coming! Um, but yeah, I will see you guys next week. I literally can't wait. Hi guys! This is how it's supposed to be Making our Christmas memories